Welcome to another lesson in your free six-day mini course. Today we're going to cover how to set up your online store website without any technical experience whatsoever. So what is this tutorial going to cover? This tutorial will teach you how to create and host your own online e-commerce store from scratch without needing to know anything about computers. If you know how to use a web browser and you know how to click the mouse, that's all the knowledge that you need. And by the end of this tutorial, you will be self-sufficient, you will own your own branded website, and you will have a feature-rich shopping cart with which to sell your goods online. Now, one of the motivations for this tutorial is many of my readers currently sell in various marketplaces such as Amazon, Etsy, and eBay. And that's great. You can sell on those and there's money to be made on those platforms. But the only way to be in control of your own destiny is by starting and owning your own branded website. And so the best way to proceed is to go ahead and maintain your Etsy, eBay, and Amazon store if you sell there, but you should be gradually transitioning over to a website that you own and have full control over. Now, I also wanted to address some of the fears. Most people actually never go to the route of owning their own website because they have the following misconceptions. So people think that owning their own online store website is expensive. People think that the whole process of creating a website is very daunting. People often have no clue how to set up a shopping cart. And one of the greatest misconceptions is that people think that they need to spend a lot of money hiring a developer in order to create their own website. And this is absolutely not true. You can easily set up a feature rich open source shopping cart for just the cost of hosting. And today, I'm going to teach you how to proceed in installing your own website and you don't need to know a thing and it's only going to cost you $3.95 a month. Okay, so let's begin. So we're going to start this tutorial on my blog at mywifequitterjob.com and I want you to scroll down and click on this link for Bluehost. Now, I have a special deal with Bluehost, whereas if you sign up, you get a 41% discount off the regular price. And we're going to be installing our shopping cart on Bluehost today. So I'm going to click here, and then I'm going to click on Get Started Now. I'm going to click on the $3.95 starter package, because that's pretty much all you need when you're first starting out. And in the last lesson, you should have already picked your domain name. And for the purposes of this example, I am going to choose myquickonlinestore.com. Okay, and I'm just going to go ahead and enter in my information here. Okay, I'm going to select the starter package here. And there's a bunch of check boxes here. I'm not going to choose domain privacy protection. You don't need Site Backup Pro, and you don't need Site Lock Domain Security. So make sure all that stuff is unchecked. And then I'm going to enter in my payment information here. OK, and you shouldn't need to choose any of these upgrades. So just go ahead and scroll down, and then hit Complete. And then you're going to go ahead and create your password for your account. And hit create. OK, so now go ahead and just log in using the password that you just specified. Bluehost is going to try to upsell you a lot of stuff, but just keep hitting not interested. And here is the control panel. This is kind of like the back end of your hosting platform where you can go ahead and install various pieces of software. Today we are going to install OpenCart, and I'm going to show you how to do that in under five minutes. So you want to go over under Website and one-click Install. Okay, and then you want to click on e-commerce here in the left-hand column. And we are going to be installing OpenCart. Go ahead and click Install. And this is where you want to install it in the root of your directory. Okay. 
Okay, and by default, the admin username is going to be admin, and I'm just going to make the admin password, and then I'm going to click install now. Okay, and as you can see here, it's installing OpenCart, so you just need to wait for a little bit as it does it. And that's it. Your install is complete. Click on View Credentials. Now if you go to myquickonlinestore.com, you'll see that OpenCart has been installed at your domain. Now I just want to show you a couple of things. You can log into the back end by going to myquickonlinestore.com slash admin. And the username and password is what we specified earlier, so I'm going to go ahead and type that in. And this is where you administer your shopping cart. So for example, under catalog, you can add categories, you can add products, you can add sales, there's a bunch of different shipping modules and that sort of thing. Basically everything that you need to run a fully featured online store is located right here in the back end. And once again, whenever you add a product, it'll show up on your online store in whatever category that you want. And that's all there is to it. And like I said, it took under five minutes. And as you can see here, it's really not that hard to launch your own website, your own branded website. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. In a subsequent lesson, I'm gonna show you how to make the site secure, accept credit cards, and get a great design template to make your online store look the way you want it to look. Okay, and once again, all this stuff that I just taught you is a small excerpt of my full-blown online store course, which is located at www.profitableonlinestore.com. Go check it out if any of this stuff interests you. Thanks.